I am the CIO of Landmark Group. We work with a lot of companies to help them transform and we're also transforming ourselves. The JLL John Zang Sal, it's a real estate advisory, commercial advisory company. So Liv is a, it's the first digital lifestyle bank in the region. Yeah. And I'm a professor in robotics and analytics. I'm the CEO of uh, Halab, a newly launched uh, service in Dubai uh, to book uh, Dubai taxis on the Karim app. I just came from the Expo 2020, so it was really perfect talking about innovation. Innovation is at the heart of kind of what we do now in Landmark, both because we're, we do fashion, we sell uh, at that end, so how do, I, how do we bring fashion to an ever-changing uh, uh, population, but uh, at the same time, so how do we innovate as far as our technologies that will allow us to bridge the gap between our stores and then our online, uh, online promises uh, to, to the customer. Um, and we talk about there being three new types of capital. First of all, there's behavioural capital, so that's really understanding, having access to data, so you can understand people's behaviour. Second type of capital is cognitive, so that's where you have the data, but you also have the algorithms to predict what's next. And then the third type of capital is kind of network capital. So this is, I have access to a network, which means I can tap into additional customers, etc. We identify two key factors to innovation. Uh, which is innovation in terms of you know, what sort of uh, R&D, research and development is there, science parks, technology, etc. on one hand. And then we looked at talents. Um, and we think talent's an essential part of innovation because even if economies and the public sector and the private sector moves towards incorporating technologies, um, you still need that human element. Uh, it's a bank targeted towards millennials uh, where they can simply take their phones, scan their Emirates ID and open an account in less than two minutes. Yeah. Uh, so it's Emirates NBD's proposition to uh, a new digital service uh, for the younger generation of customers. We focus a lot on sustainability um, and there is actually a platform at Expo 2020 of sustainability, um, whether it's a fuel alternate vehicles, whether it's use of technology, drones, um, how we dispatch our drivers that make deliveries. There's an optimal way that we dispatch them to be more efficient and save on the environment from fuel. Innovation is super important right now and now we have a government mandate that as a university we have to innovate so we're taking it very seriously. So we started programs of incubation and we start a program of patents to help professors to patent their research. Because what we do is we actually leverage very progressive technologies and implement them to a service that's already fully functional and working. So we've added 5,500 experienced taxi drivers uh, to the Karim app and we train them. So now the changes for the markets are customers have access to a system that's much more affordable, much more available and uh, they have a number of benefits that they didn't have before.